welcome this is the energy vibration for the cancer sun moon and rising sign and this is the week I want to say thank you for being here thank you for being back thank you for your support thank you for your likes and shares and I want to say to each and every person out there I'm happy for everything that you have done for me this is the week this is your week and it is such a positive week for you cancers because you have the um, two major arcana you have your own energy vibration and it is the energy of the week but yet still you have the star and this is good this is two of the best major arcana cards that you can receive whatever the situation is whatever is happening you need to understand that this energy vibration of the week and the lovers is going to be a very positive one in whatever way you're going to look at it you're going to see that there are positive situations that are coming up okay so this is good as we look at this week you have the zodiac energy of fire and with a zodiac energy of fire you have positive energy that is going to come in and this positive situation is going to be one of wonderful energy vibration that is going to happen okay so um you need to be aware of uh, how you deal with certain aspect in the relationship of love okay the king of pentacles is going to come into this week the king of pentacles is going to come into this week there is going to be money coming towards you and um, it's going to be a lot of money the energy vibration in this week is very balanced out you will have um, all the elements working for you in this week let's see what other messages do we have for you cancers what other messages do we have for you cancers what other messages do we have for you cancers whatever messages do we have for you cancers oh my gosh oh my gosh okay we have the energy of your energy is going to be of sorry the hangman in reverse the hangman in reverse with the energy of the lovers the hangman in reverse with the energy of the lovers whatever is happening you have the hangman in reverse with the energy of the lovers so this is the week of the lovers and it's all about relationship it's all about your intimate relationship and your business relationship whatever is going on it's all about your intimate relationship and your business relationship so you need to understand that in this week in this situation you are going to see positive situation coming in because your week is crowned with the energy of the two of swords so you are looking for clarity and this um, card set that I'm using the two of swords in upright is that you're going to find clarity in this week to certain situation with your love relationship um, the week is the, the, the basis of the week is going to be of uh, money and work work and money whatever that situation that arise for you it's going to be of money 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 um money is going to be the energy vibration of this so whatever is happening you need to understand what is taking place in this week okay let's look and see there is a lot of sword energy and there's a lot of people that are going to have be having conflicts and walking away from their relationship on Tuesday it's going to decide that I am going to end this relationship there's a lot of sword energy but they're in the reverse form which is very good whenever they're in the upright form they're in, you know so some people are going to walk away from their relationship some people are going to have um, your dreams and your dreams and wishes are going to come out but um, with consequences so, your dreams and wishes are going to come out but with consequences because you have two four six so one seven um, seven of swords so uh, your dream on, but it's in the reverse form so that is good so whatever that was blocking your dream and wishes and people were trying to take something away from you it's not going to happen because you're going to see a positive energy that is coming out to change this energy vibration on Monday you have the four of cups in this card deck this four of cups is a positive one because you're trying to balance out your emotional situation okay whatever the situation is this four of cups is balancing out your emotional situation and what you are going to get with that is the seven of cups because once your emotional situation is 
going to be balanced out then it is going to be clear what is going to be happening so good things will be coming in good opportunities positive opportunities um, people are going to be co connecting with you you're going to be having these ideas and dreams of these ideas coming up so this is going to be extremely positive so whatever the situation is you're going to be extremely positive on Tuesday is your best day um, because whatever a relationship or a situation that was it can be a friendship that you're going to bring an end to and walk away from it and think yeah this is not something for me which is going to be better off for you because um, we're always judged by the people who we have in our lives even if they are bad and yet still they have something good about them we're always judged about them so is the saying is always a birds of a feather flock together but it's not always uh, it's not always the case because sometimes in a group there's always one good person and maybe that person wants to do something for humanity so uh, you know um, especially people who are light workers and way shores always can connect with people who need their help and um, whatever the situation is you're going to think you know this is not something for me this is not who the people who I want to have in my life and you're going to you know like move yourself away from it so it's not specific that you're ending a relationship for some people you're you have ended a relationship but you're moving on for some people you're ending a situation with a group of people that have a connection that you had a connection with for a very long time you're thinking you know I don't want to be um, in the presence of these people because it's not giving me any positive energy so it's going to be something like that as we move forward and the crowning of your week is the two of swords so you're seeing things clearer now um, whatever that was blocking you you're seeing things clearer now and with that two of swords you're going to decide to move away and look for something much better on the horizon so this is very good so whatever situation that was happening whatever um, you're leaving behind a group of men in situation it can be career changes too I'm seeing a lot of career changes happening in this week so it could be career changes so you're leaving behind a group of people and situation and you're moving to something which is much better and the door of opportunities are going to open up and it's going to be much better for you you know sometimes you vibrate with some people with their energy vibration that is so negative as we move forward we have the energy vibration of the star on Thursday which is another good day for you guys and the star brings out something and um, what it does is as if your angels and guides have seen that something of a negative force that was in your life that people were trying to steal certain things from you and the universe came in and stand up and you know um, break it so the energy of the star whatever that was happening and people were trying to steal it's not going to happen because your angels and guides or the spirit guides the source created a source of all things is re 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 given you it's as if nothing that was meant for you is ever lost if something was meant for you you're going to have it depends on whatever people will do with negative energies negative forms whatever if something was meant for you and in your blueprint that is what you're going to get and sometimes whenever people passed over like your spirit guides um, your parents or or, or people who have always protect you in this lifetime when they were um, here on this planet they always help from out of the spirit realms help you uh, to make sure things fall in place so that you can gain what they have left behind for you so whatever that is I don't know that was a message okay we have the five of Pentacles so we are going to have conflicts with the king of Pentacles whatever that situation is there is going to be a conflict with the king of Pentacles so let's understand what is going on um, whoever which you it could be a conflicts with a scorpion or a Pisces scorpion yeah conflicts with a Pisces or a scorpion um, whatever this conflict is try and understand that there are so certain situations that you need to deal with and conflicts comes up when there needs to be a clearing of energies between 
two persons or a group of people. So as I've always said to people, there is three and four sides to a situation. So you need to understand what is happening. And as you understand what is happening with that situation, um, use love um, to heal whatever situation is going on around you. Use love to heal whatever situation is going around you. And then you are going to feel yourself being vibrating at a good energy vibration. On Saturday, you have the Nine of Pentacles, and the Nine of Pentacles um, is coming from the King of Wands. Whoever this person was that has done you something on justice, um, he's bringing you the Nine of Pentacles. He has to pay you money. He has done something, and he has to pay you money. Whatever the situation is, he has done you something, and he has to pay you money. Um, for some people, it's, it's going to be financial help coming from your father or um, a parent. And for some people, it's going to be financial situation coming from organization, especially for people who are looking for finance, uh, for study financiering and uh, um, um, study financiering and um, um, investment. So this money is going to come to you whether from whatever money or it's going to come to you it's as, as if um you have asked and you have been trying to receive this money and this money is just going to come to you just uh, out of you know the blues but it's going to help you with whatever financial situation you have okay so be aware of um this on Sunday, we have the energy vibration of the King of Pentacles and the Queen of Pentacles. So this is wonderful. So whatever is happening for you, um, Cancers, if you're connected to the King of Pentacles or the Queen of Pentacles, it is going to be a very, very good because it's the energy of the lovers of the week and the lovers came up three times. So whatever is happening, you are going to connect with these pentacles people and um, the zodiac, the general zodiac energies is that you cancers are good with the energy vibration of the pentacle piece people. So mostly the Capricorns with the Capricorns people. So some of you are going to be connecting with either a Taurus, a Virgo, or a Capricorn in love, and it's going to be wonderful. It's going to be positive. It's going to be um, a week when this connection is going to bring you inner peace, but yet still a happiness within you, a bliss. You're going to feel a bliss in this relationship. But you end, end the week with this connection of the King and Queen of Pentacles. So obviously, um, if you're a cancer looking for a relationship, connect with the queen or king of pentacles because this is a positive, positive energy for you, cancer. So this is going to be wonderful in love. It's going to be a week where, where you're going to be connecting with people who are very positive, people who are going to help you business-wise, but also emotional um, help is coming up also for you and it's going to be the people who carry the earth energy vibration because you're a water sign so the water sign always connect with the earth people and you're going to be bringing in balance in a lot of ways whatever the situation is however you can deal with the situation you're going to see that the energy vibration of these people are going to bring positive energy in your life the overcoupling of your week it is uh, um and i said i will give the energy you know it's all about um connecting with someone connecting with a soulmate connecting it's it's really the week of love and it's also the week of love for you whatever situation that has been going on whatever that has been happening in your um, relationship with love it is going to clear up now okay because whatever conflict you had with relationship with the king and queen of pentacles which is a, with a Taurus, a virgo or a capricorn it's going to be cleared up now whatever that conflict was it's going to come to an end it's going to clear up now okay so 
as we look forward and we're looking at certain aspect the love aspect that Monday is going to be the day where love is going to come in where people are going to be you know relationships you're going to meet people and on Monday is somehow for you guys it's going to be the day of love whatever the situation is Monday is going to really be the day of love you are vibrating on Friday so whatever conflicts you are going to have with a Taurus a Virgo or a Capricorn on Friday it's going to be okay um, you need to clear the energy with this situation as we move forward and we're looking at the energy of the lovers it's really a powerful week of the lover the number six is here so six um, is going to be positive six three tar um, two times two times two times two times two times so six and then 66 and that is just materialistic and also the energy of love okay so um, people are afraid of the this number six but it's it's just the earthly energy of love and materialistic things be aware of whatever is going on understand whatever is going on you need to understand where you are how your position the things you need in your life you need to be a positive and you need to have a positive um, sense in the beginning of the week it's all about love it's all about you leaving a situation behind balancing out certain aspect and certain situation you have also the energy of the king of um, the king of of, of ones um, bringing you money whatever the situation is this person needed to pay you some money whatever the situation is so whatever is happening you need to understand that and accept what is going on you have the energy of the star and the energy of the star whatever that was stolen from you will be returned and you have the energy of the king and queen of pentacles that there is going to be a conflict and this has to be cleared up whatever the situation is it has to be cleared up let's ask a question what else transformation so there is going to be a huge transformation and this is going to be positive this is going to be positive this is going to be a huge transportation transformation that is going to be happening in your life so this is going to be a positive one okay this is absolutely going to be a positive one so whatever the transformation is because it's the number is the debt so it's going to be transformation so of course this is what you have to deal with um, you are finding your light and you know if you were in a position where you weren't feeling um, optimis optimism and that sort of a thing then you see the energy vibration of the energy of the lovers and this transformation is happening and the debt and transformation so whatever the situation is you need to understand how you are going to um, change certain aspects and certain energy vibration over the energy of love and this has to do with your personal life relationships and people in your life the last and final energies that I have uh, um, let's see what the ascendance masters message are for you guys in this week and it's Orion I honor the masters of Orion and visit them in my sleep the great masters of Orion invites you to visit Orion in meditation or sleep to receive a download cosmic wisdom this is an honor so prepare yourself with intention during the daytime by showering lighting a candle and playing music or walking in nature then you will receive much spiritual light Orion is the soul chakra of the universe you may find it's helpful to um, ask Archangel Mallory to lighten up your personal solar chakra which is above your head to facilitate your connection I honor the master of Orion and visit them in my sleep this is your final messages and I'm wishing you a wonderful positive week namaste